Hi, I'm Miss Melissa from the Elmwood Place branch. Today we will be doing Rainbow Celery. We've partnered with the Greater Cincinnati STEM Collaborative on this project that you can do at home. For this project, you will need clear jars or glasses. You can use plastic cups, but make sure they are see-through. You will also need food coloring. I chose red, blue, yellow, and green. Finally, you will need some celery. Make sure you have an adult help you cut the celery. First, we are going to add food coloring to each glass. Make sure that you use the same amount of water in each glass. I used one cup in each glass. You can add as many drops of food coloring as you want. More is better and will hopefully show more vibrant color on the celery. I decided to do 10 drops of red, eight drops of blue, six drops of yellow, and four drops of green food coloring. Notice how I'm squeezing carefully so I don't accidentally do more than I want. We are going to track the number of drops on an observation sheet. You will want to use a different amount for each color so you can see how the amount of color drops affects the color pigment. Then place the celery in the glasses, stalk side down. Let the celery sit overnight. Here is an example of an observation sheet I used to track my experiment. The next day, you can remove your celery from the water and check the colors of the stalk and the leaves. As you can see, the green had a little effect on the leaves. There are darker green in some places. Since yellow is so light, you can only see it on the top of the stalk and not really on the leaves. Since the blue is darker, you can see it more on the leaves. Remember, we also used more blue drops than green and yellow. Finally, you can see the red on the leaves pretty well. How does the color get to the leaves? Because of capillary action. The dissolved food coloring moves through the water through the xylon tubes in the celery. This travels up the stalk and into the leaves. Goodbye, thanks for watching. This video was produced in partnership with the Greater Cincinnati STEM Collaborative. For more STEM activities, visit greatercincystem.org.